Hey everybody, this is Lauren with Lauren's Line Dancing. I've got my little littlest line dancer here. Um, we are going to teach you one of my dances called uh, Can't Help Myself. It's a 32 count, I'd say like high beginner, maybe-ish, I don't know. Um, it goes to the song I Can't Help Myself or Can't Help Myself by Dean Brody. It's a really fun song, um, it talks about liking beer and whatnot. Um, anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and show it to you and then we will dive into it. It is 32 counts. There are two, three, four restarts. Um, no tags, so that's nice. Um, but there are four restarts. And so uh, you'll be able to hear it once you're familiar with the song. When he dives into the, I like cold beer, yes I do. I like cold beer, how about you? That is gonna be the restart all the time. So our very front wall, I will turn around, our window wall over there is gonna be 12 o'clock. Um, that always is the same, um, 32, just straight 32. And then when we face our three o'clock and our nine o'clock, you're gonna be dancing 16 counts of the dance and then it restarts and then you do the normal 32. The first time you face our six o'clock or the back wall, um, you're going to dance 24 counts into the dance and then you restart from the top. You dance the 32 and that's it. So basically, this is going to be sounding like some math, but you're going to do 32 on the front wall, 16 and then 32 on our three o'clock. You're going to be doing 24 and then 32 on our six o'clock. And then we're going to do 16 and then 32 on our nine o'clock. The front is always 32, so you'll do a 32, and you'll do 16, 32, and then you're gonna land on our back wall and we're just gonna do a straight 32. Okay, so it's normal, restart, 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 normal, restart, normal. It's a pretty short song. So anyway, once you're familiar, you'll get the hang of it. I'm gonna go ahead and turn off this funky light. Oops, just cause it's going a bit crazy. So. I'm gonna go ahead and face the other side. I'm gonna show it to you. I'll do two, uh, two walls so that you can see that 16 into the 32. All right. Five, six, seven, eight. If there's work, you don't want to work. And if there's dirt, this old drunk don't swirl. If there's pretty girls sitting on tailgates, they just say the word. This is his new walk. Here's 16 counts. Then you restart here. Heels. did our normal 32, I did 16 into the 32, and I did like eight counts on this wall. So let's go ahead and start facing this way. We're gonna start full weight on the left. We're gonna do a heel, and then a heel, and then a heel, and you're gonna slap either your ankle or your heel, your right and your right. So it's gonna be heel and heel and heel, slap, heel, and then come center. Basically the same thing on the left. Heel and heel and heel slap. Instead of another heel, you're gonna stomp your left foot forward and wait onto it. So it's gonna be, let's go back here a little bit so you can see. It's gonna be right and left and right slap, right center, left and right and left slap stomp so counts are going to be one and two and three and four and left side five and six and seven and eight doing okay so far a little bit faster five six right heel right and left and right slap and left and right and left slap stop. From here we're gonna do two half pivots. 
over our left shoulder. So you just did that left stomp. You're going to full weight onto that. You're going to take two half pivot steps. So right foot forward, turn around, right foot forward, turn around. You're going to do a right stomp and a left stomp, stomp, stomp. And then you have two counts to do whatever you want with your hips. I normally do two little hip circles. You can do bumps, you can twerk. I don't care what you do, okay? So that, um, let's see, we just stumped our left at the end of our first eight. We're gonna do those pivots. One, two, three, stumps, five, six, seven, and eight. Okay, let's go ahead and squish everything so far together. Full weight on the left. We're going to start those heels with a slap. Five, six, seven, eight. Heel and heel and heel slap. Other side. Heel and heel and slap with a stomp. Half a turn. Half a turn. Stomp. Stomp. Circle with hips. Weight on your left or be prepared to shift weight to your left at the end of that. That is going to be 16 counts right there. So. When we're dancing our three o'clock and our uh, three and nine o'clock, math is hard, three and nine, um, that is where you're gonna chop and then restart the dance. So if we were facing this wall, we would do our heels, heels, we would do our pivot, pivot, stomp, stomp, hips. Then we would hear the, I like cold beer, yes I do, I like cold beer, how about you? Okay, that's how that goes. But anyway, now you know 16 counts. Let's dive into the next set. Um, so, we just did stomp, stomp, circle, circle. Uh, what we're gonna do is a funky little, kind of like a wizard step, kind of not, I'm not really sure what to call it, but it's fine. We're gonna step one, two, and then, so it's kind of like a little pop. Step, pop. Then we're gonna shuffle on a slight diagonal, right, left, right. We're gonna do the exact same thing on the left. Step, pop, shuffle on the left. That's gonna be our full set of eight. So it's gonna be, let's see, stomp, stomp, hip, hip for five, six, seven, eight. We're gonna step one, two, three, and four. Left side, five, six, seven, and eight should land weighted on the left there. So let's go ahead and squish everything we know so far, starting with our heels. Full weight on the left to start. Start with the right heel, five, six, seven, eight. Heel and heel and slap, and heel and heel and slap. Half turns, one, two, three, four, five, six, and those step pops. Step, pop, shuffle on the right. Step, pop, shuffle on the left. All right, so we're almost there. That right there is where you will restart the dance the first time you face the back wall. So when you face six o'clock, you're dancing 24 counts in, and then you restart with the heel, heel, heels. So that'll look like all the heels, then you do your turns, then you do your little step top things, and then you would start your heels when you're facing your six, uh, six o'clock. Okay, so now we know all of our restart points. Let's learn the very last section. This section is how you face your new wall. So, so far we've been facing our front wall the whole time. At the very end, we're gonna quarter turn to our three o'clock and start all over from there. So, we just did step, pop, shuffle on the left. So what we're gonna do is called a rocking chair. So at this point, your full weight on the left you're gonna rock forward, recover, rock back, and recover. So right foot goes forward, one, recover, two, back, three, recover, four. So rock forward, recover, rock back, recover. I'm gonna go ahead and scoot this way just a little bit so that we can have a little bit of a runway over here. So we just did one, two, three, four. We're gonna do a quick, like grapevine thing, and then a big spin at the end. So it's gonna look like five and six. So I just stepped my right foot out, left behind. My right toes 
I'm going to point at my three o'clock. From here, this is that big spin that I was talking about. So this is six, seven, eight, you're going to turn. So it's kind of hard for me to do slow, so I'm going to go ahead and show you this full eight, and then I'll try and break down that spin. So we're going to look one, two, three, four, five, and six. We need to do a full turn and face our three o'clock. So what I do, I'm going to be weighted on my right. I'm going to spin and use my left to kind of like push myself around. That's going to be seven. And then I'm going to step backwards onto my left foot and kind of sit into it. And that's eight. I should be able to pick up my right foot. That's eight. And then we start the dance again with our right heel, left heel, right slap, right. So that spin, six, my right toes are pointed towards three o'clock. I'm going to kind of spin myself around on my left and then that's going to be seven. This position right now is kind of seven. I'm going to continue over my right shoulder going this way. I'm going to sit back. You don't really need to sit, but like make sure you're weighted back on that left foot so that you can start your heels all over again. So let's go ahead and try from the rock point into the spin. Again, this is much slower than the dance, but that's all right. Full weight on the left, rocking forward on the right. One, recover, two, back, three, recover, four, five, and six, spin, seven, land, eight. And then you use your right heel to kind of help balance yourself so you don't tip over. So that is the whole 32 counts. Let's go ahead and face our front, do it all together. Full weight left. Five, six, start your heels. Heel and heel and heel slap, heel, heel and heel, and now we pivot turn. Half a turn, half dog, do your stomp, 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 hips, step pop thing. One, two, shuffle, three and four, five, six, shuffle and rock forward. One, two, three, four, out behind, out, turn and land. Then you start all over from the top again. All right. I hope that that was helpful. Go ahead and rewind as many times as you need. Again, remember, this is 32 counts. Three o'clock is gonna be 16, then 32. Your back wall is gonna be 24 counts, and then 32 counts. Your nine o'clock is 16 counts, 32 counts. Forward, a normal 32. You'll hit three o'clock one more time for 16, then 32, and you'll land on the very back, and that's just a straight 32. Okay. Oof. Good luck. Feel free to write that out if you need to. Um, anyway, it's a good one. Not terribly bad. I don't think. Uh, oh, if you didn't want to do the full spin at the end. Um, let's see. How did we modify that earlier? Out behind, out. You can't just kind of quarter turn. So it could look like one, two, three, four, five and six, seven, eight, heel. So you just kind of like tap your right foot into a heel or do the spin or do whatever makes sense for you. Okay, we'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.